So I had a couple of messages a fortnight ago, because me and my brother come and camped one night here. People say, oh, why would you bother going for one night? A lot of hassle. Well, depends on how you look at it. For us, if I come camping one night, whether it's with Kerry or um, with my brother or someone, generally like to get there early, make a whole day of it, enjoy the night, have breakfast the next morning, and then shoot off. Now, we haven't done many one nights, believe me, but we have an easy setup. So, as you can see, because it's just me and my brother, I've just got my swag, a table, get a um, cook thing out later. Very simple, I'll have a fire later. Now, if Kerry wanted to come just for the one night, and she wanted a gazebo up, she wanted a tent up, not a problem. That's not a big deal. I'd rather go camping for one night and none at all. Like, we wouldn't go travelling far for one night unless we were on the road trip and we just wanted to do the one night somewhere, then that's different. But yeah, when you've got a good setup, you know what you're doing, um, it's quick and easy. Um, one night, it's nothing wrong having one night, especially going through COVID, you need to get out the house. Um, and I have no problems doing one night if I have to, or if I want to. And if Kerry had come, I would, I'd probably um, put a swag up for Kerry, um, or put um, the tent up, which just doesn't take long. Beats sitting at home, doing nothing, out in the fresh air, cook over a fire or cook on your stove, having a, just having a chat about nothing. Just talking crap. You might see some fellow campers, you might have a low, say hello to him, you might have a bit of a chat to him. And that. But it's good for your mental state, if nothing else. So that's about it guys. Cheers.